let me say this. There may be some people who can memorize Bible scriptures so well. There may be some people who may read the Bible so much. But the problem I see, some people just don't trust in God. What good is it to read so much? To read the Bible so much? What good is it to memorize so many scripture? What good is it? Because what I see in some people, when they get into trouble or have some issues, they know what to do from the Bible, but some choose to, I believe, some choose to go by their feelings, go by their own way of thinking when they know what the Bible says. So it is not only good to hear people teach about the Bible. It is not only good to read what the Bible is saying. Do it. <laughs> you have to do it. When you do it, I am telling you, it does something to you to where it changes something within you. I know for myself, back when I was in sin, I was a really mean guy. Really, really mean. But when I started to act upon the principles of the Bible, it is like my heart changed. My heart became much more soft to where I cry so much now, which is very, very strange. So it is not only good to listen or to hear what the Bible is saying, you have to do it, act upon it. Well, Kevin, I'm not sure because what if things get worse? Listen, you are going by your own way of thinking. There is a person that I would speak to, and this person, as it seems, knows so much about the Bible, so much. Perhaps that person know much more than I, by far. But from my understanding, that person is not really acting upon what he or she knows. And that is the problem. So it is not about how smart you are or how wise you are. It is about doing, acting upon what you know. And then when you do that, I believe, and I can be wrong, when you act upon the Bible, God is going to give you more wisdom to act upon. So with the wisdom that you have now, and if you are not acting upon it, why would God give you more wisdom? Think about that. Let me stop here. God bless you.